Jerry Miller was set to graduate from Central High School in Fort Wayne in the class of 1956. But before that could happen, he enlisted to help with the cleanup with the Korean War. He was never given the diploma he deserved until now. And I said, how would I go getting a replacement diploma for 1956? Did you think it was a joke at first? Well, yes. But soon Jerry Miller found out the joke was the work of a determined daughter. And it really wasn't a joke at all. His daughter, Tony Moon, got him his certified high school diploma 61 years later. But the story starts back in 1956 with a sacrifice. A few of us at school left to go to Korea. And I guess we never thought about our education, you know, the, the future. When he returned on leave a year later, he got his GED, then went to see his principal for his diploma. He said, I'm tired of you kids quitting school and expecting a diploma for nothing, and he threw it away. Miller went on to serve in the Navy for two more years, then held down a successful career until retirement, all without his diploma. But decades later, he and his daughter were talking. He said that one of his biggest regrets was never getting his high school diploma. So Moon got to work. She got his transcript from the Fort Wayne Community Schools where Central High School was a part of before it closed, then got a certified diploma just in time to give it to him for his 79th birthday. I was glad to get it. I'm glad, glad my daughter went through all the trouble of getting it. As the years go on, Miller still thinks back on his decision to quit school for the military. He says he's glad he served but regrets quitting school. And he has a message for those thinking of doing the same. If anybody's thinking about quitting school, it's not, it's not the way to go. To make this story even sweeter, Jostens, the company that printed the diploma, waived any fee. Just grateful to help make the long-deserved diploma.